You spend the first year mainly getting to know what interior design is, because uh, a lot of people have a sort of disturbed preconception of interior design as being curtains and cushions. Um, and you learn how to use the computer programs that you will need in the next couple of years to develop your work further. You get set projects throughout the year, so instead of it being sit-down lectures or anything um, like that, you, you have different projects that you have to do. Um, they can be anything, sort of, there's not even, there's, there's briefs for them, but they're not strict to the brief, so. Um, we learned AutoCAD, which is what we use to do the more um, blueprint style drawings. Um, and then there's SketchUp, which we use for doing 3D work. So using, to make, if you're designing a building, you can build that building up in SketchUp so that you get a bit of a better visual of it. And obviously when you're going into practice in future, clients like to see a 3D version of it because they can visualize it a bit better that way. The brief started when I chose my building um, in Blackburn. It was an old cotton mill, but it was called The Exchange. And I was thinking of different things that I could use for this, but I could use this building for. And I kept playing on the word exchange, um, and I decided to turn it into a casino and a restaurant and a bar. Um, and so then, through looking into casinos, I discovered that there's a lot of deception in casinos, and they they control the natural light in casinos so that you can't you have no idea of what time it is in there. So it sort of becomes a timeless space, which is something that I wanted to recreate in mind, but with a different twist on it. Instead of having it sort of a dark, oppressive type place, um, having it really bright and, and warping, the, warping the space sort of vertically and horizontally by using like different techniques and things. So, Well, I've, I've got an internship already. I started on Monday. Um, I'm working in an in interior design practice in Blackburn. Um, we're currently working on more sort of residential and commercial projects like schools and things like that um, but I hope to eventually to work for more of an architect's office in in London doing the interior sort of structural work. Favourite thing for me was a project that we did in second year um, where we designed areas of the, the Fylde building um, and I designed a, a scheme for the entrance area and that's been built now so with help from the design lab, I'll have to add that in as well. But yeah, that's been that's been built now. So that's a that was a really like impressive feeling for me as well because to to leave university already having something that you've designed been built is an amazing feeling. Well, I don't know if I've got a mark yet, but I do have best in show, so.